Hi everyone, welcome to the first part of my Luna Freya cosplay series. Today I'm going to be talking you through how I made this. So here I have my initial plan. I drew this up on the computer and I have all the measurements on here. I just went out and I bought this which is about two meters but I'm going to cut it and then I have this board and I'm going to draw the the top of the trident onto this and then I'm going to layer it with these foam sheets. I wanted to get some of the big blocks of foam but they didn't have any of them so I'm just going to have to use this and then paper mache. I drew this design bigger and I put it onto a piece of paper and then I drew around this onto a piece of wood and I'm now going to cut this out and try and get it so that the tube slots into the bottom. So I started layering the foam and this is what it looks like now. There's five sheets in there and I just drew them out and then put two sheets together and then cut it so it would be faster but because I'm a bit stupid I forgot that I needed to attach this thing and now I can't because the foam's in the way so I'm gonna have to cut this bit of the foam on either side so I can slide it on and so I can fit it on I've cut this a bit so it will slide onto the wood and then I'll just glue it in place. Okay here is what I've done so far. I attached the top of the trident to the pole and then I started paper macheing it. To get the end spikes raised, I put some foam standing upright and hot glued it along the end of the trident. And then I just paper mache over it to give it some kind of 3D sort of look. And now I need to do the second layer and add on the other little details to the trident's pole and the little point at the end. I've just finished the second layer of paper mache and now I just need to add the wings that go onto the side and I need to add the arrow that goes onto the bottom. I just cut a load of shapes out and these are going to be the side pieces, like the little wings that go onto the side and I just started layering them out and now I'm going to hot glue them and I made this out of a pet food box. Here are the end pieces that I also cut out. I still need to glue them on. I've also just paper mache these two pieces and these are going to stick onto the front and back of the trident's head. And that's just to give it more definition because if I had these on before and then I paper mache over the top, they wouldn't stand out as much. So I'm probably going to paint these separately and then paint this and put them and stick them all together. All the pieces that need to be stuck on have now been glued on with hot glue. These bits were quite difficult to stick on because it was quite hard to balance the staff as well as using the hot glue to get them on and trying to get them straight, but I tried my best. Here is their trident so far and now it's completely covered in paper mache. I'm just going to do one more layer of glue before I paint it. I'll do all the painting in another part which should come out soon. Here's what it looks like so far. And I'll show you some more pictures. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next part.